Tiamat, one of D&D's biggest baddies. This goddess of greed is the five-headed queen of evil dragons, each head representing one of the five chromatic dragons. She has all the power of the chromatic dragons, including all of their breath weapons, and is often portrayed with some wyvern similarities as well, such as the massive venomous stinger for a tail. But did you know that Tiamat was also a primordial goddess in ancient Mesopotamian mythology? She was the personification of the Salt Sea with associations to the chaos of all creation. She went to war against the gods after their dancing stirred her seas, annoying her. The Elder Gods convinced her to raise an army of monsters to strike the new gods down, but she was defeated by the legendary hero Marduk. And from her remains, he created the heavens, arranging the sun, moon, and constellations, and the earth, forming mountains and continents. She became known as the mother of the gods, ironically. Tiamat was originally depicted as either a woman or a massive body of water, but her affiliation with her army of monsters that she raised caused her to begin to take on draconic imagery, hence her semi-adaptation into the Faerunian pantheon. 